Hey guys, welcome to my channel. Welcome back to another video. If you're new here, my name is Wyre. If you're returning, welcome, grab a drink. Let's get comfortable. In today's video, we're talking about fragrances. And as you can tell from the title, spring fragrances. Winter and fall perfumes are gradually going to be shelved. And if you're in the market for something that is going to be fruity, floral, sensual, then sit down because I'm gonna be sharing with you guys five fragrances that you can start to incorporate into your spring summer vibe. When I think of spring, I think of floral, juicy, light, fresh, feminine. Those are kind of like the scents and the kind of fragrance and feel that I want to get when I'm wearing a perfume. So I thought I would share with you guys some of the ones that I have in my collection. If you're not subscribed to my channel, please hit the subscribe button, turn on the notification bell so you get notified every time I post a new video and I will see you guys in my next one. First fragrance that I want to share with you guys is La Via Belle and this is such a beautiful fragrance. This is hands down one of my favorite fragrance and I consider it to be like my date night scent and I wear this all year round but this is such a perfect fragrance to incorporate into like spring. It has powdery notes to it and also has floral notes to it and I love that it has vanilla. I'm a vanilla girl. I like to smell sweet and this has such a sweet smell to it. So off the bat when you first take a whiff of this um, fragrance the top notes that you kind of get are pear and black currant and the base notes that you kind of get as well is like vanilla the middle notes are more jasmine more floral and like orange blossom and this smells absolutely beautiful when i think of this fragrance i think of like you know just being in a really nice you know pastel light pastel beautiful dress and I'm out with a bouquet of flowers and just having the time of my life. It is such a beautiful fragrance and it is very sexy and very sensual at the same time. Oh, it is really just bringing all of those vibes that you get when you think of spring. When I think of spring, I think of like, you know, flowers actually blossoming and this just in embodies all of that with the fruity notes and the floral notes it's beautiful I love that the powdery scent to it is not overpowering and not overbearing because sometimes that can be a little bit too much and you just really smell like dusting powder and nobody really wants to smell like that but this is such a beautiful fragrance I know that there's another version of the Levia Bell and that's the one that has like the crystallized um, bottle if you see that one, and I know I've said this before, get that one because it's equally as beautiful as this one. And that's probably going to be my next purchase. But this is such a beautiful fragrance. I personally wear it for date nights and anytime I have somewhere special to go to, but it's a beautiful, beautiful fragrance. The next fragrance that I wanna share with you, this is more of a fresh fragrance to me, is Electric Sky by Tory Burch. I actually got this when I went for an event that one of my creator friends, Alma, had in collaboration with them. And one of the things that they did was have us in engrave something on the bottle, which I thought was really nice to add like a personal touch to it. But this fragrance is such a fresh fragrance. When I think of this, I think of like blue skies, ocean, that kind of feel. So absolutely love this scent. This will be the kind of stuff that I would want to wear to work, but if you're into that, clean girl kind of look you want to smell light fresh this is definitely something that i would you know be wearing on those kind of days when i think of this i think of like white floor white dress on the beach front and you can kind of tell with the notes that it has so the top notes that you get are like violet and blue sage the middle notes that you get with this are more like lavender and it is so beautiful and the base notes that you get is palo santos i'm not sure what that is but let me tell you this is such a beautiful light airy kind of fragrance and definitely something that I will be picking up more during spring. It's just giving that whole vibe. It gives that, you know, floral feel to it, but very fresh, very like, you know, awake. Absolutely love this fragrance. And I'm so glad I picked this. This is just perfect. And the name again is Electric Sky. Another fragrance that I wanted to share is C by Giorgio Armani. I actually have two fragrances that I'm actually going to be sharing by this brand. But C has always been a fragrance that I've always had in my collection. It has such a nice, you know, woody, 
floral scent to it as well as a little bit of spice. I love how this fragrance just smells. Um, it has notes of May Rose. It also have patchouli in it and you can also get a little bit of vanilla in it. It's not very vanilla E, if that's such a word, but it is a very beautiful fragrance. It's the kind of fragrance that I would see myself wearing at night if I had to go out with a nice, you know, light, you know, spring dress and I still want to smell like a baddie. This is definitely that fragrance, but one that I've had in my collection and keep purchasing over and over again. Another fragrance that I wanted to share is by Giorgio Armani. I did say that I had two of these in my collection and this is My Way. This is such a gorgeous floral fragrance. I love that it has that white floral scent to it. Um, also has a little bit of vanilla, but it is so airy. And when I think of this, you know, fragrance, I kind of think of, you know, hair pulled back, nice dress, but I'm actually at a corporate event. It's a very beautiful fragrance. Some of the notes that you get with this is orange blossom, bergamot, tuberose. You get tuberose in there, a little bit of jasmine, Madagascar vanilla, and you know, just a little bit of white moss. This is such a beautiful fragrance. There's something about it, and more especially as the weather, weather starts to warm up, this will be something that will just engulf the whole place and fill up a room. It's also pretty light, so it kind of gives that delicate feel to it. And I think it's a beautiful fragrance that you should have during spring and even summer. Now, if you're thinking of adding anything into your spring co summer collection, then I would honestly recommend Nest Serville Orange Perfume Oil. This is a gorgeous perfume oil. I love everything about it. It gives you orange, it gives you grapefruit, it gives you juicy, it gives you citrus, it gives you all of those notes that just make you feel like eating the person. I absolutely love this. And one of the ways that I've been loving this is by combining it with like a body or body lotion or, you know, body cream and just letting it just sink into my skin. Absolutely beautiful. A little goes a long way. And when you first like open this, it's like, oh my God, juices, literally juicy. You literally want to eat it all up. Absolutely love this. This is an amazing perfume oil to have. Nest makes great fragrances, but this particular one, I've tried the other ones like very in passing just to smell them, but this one just gives you all of that. And that's how I kind of see spring and summer, you know, in those kind of light with those kind of notes and definitely one that you should be putting in your collection. So yes, those are the five fragrances that I would highly recommend for you guys to add into your collection for spring. I want to know what kind of fragrances you guys love to rock during spring and some of the ones that you think I should be checking out and I'm going to go like, you know, take a whiff to see if it's something that I want to add. Let me know what your thoughts are in the comment section. Don't forget to like, share, subscribe, and I will see you guys in my next one. Bye.